Hey, what's up, guys? Uh, just finished Raw, and let's just say NXT is taken over, literally, because Sasha, Charlotte, and Becky made their Raw debuts and couldn't have been any better. It was just pretty much the best thing, the best Divas segment for Raw I've ever watched in quite a while. And for those who watch Raw, like, every fan, you know the Divas segments are usually the ones where you just tune out, do your own thing, and then it's over, then you're back on watching Raw again. But this one's, this time it was different. This time, a much needed kick in the face and new blood and all, whatever, whatever cliche you want to use, they're, and they're, I hopefully think, um, they can be used very well, especially Charlotte, um, Sasha, who seems to be siding with uh, Naomi in this whole thing. So basically, it's Becky, Charlotte, and Paige, Alicia Fox, and the Bellas, Naomi, Tamina, and Sasha. You can put those in a Eight, eight women, like any combo you want to look at, you want to look at, you know. Hopefully they do a um, some kind of thing at SummerSlam, and maybe even Takeover. Even when the, the even if the Bella showed up at a Takeover, that would be sweet. But yeah, it is what it is. They showed up on Raw tonight and made it amazing. Uh, other notables from Raw: um, Lesnar being Lesnar took out Kane in a pretty nasty uh, stairs to the foot and um, kind of thing. And I don't know what they're planning for Kane. I, a couple months ago, I heard some rumblings that they're going to like make some kind of retirement match for him, but who knows what they're going to do with him. I mean, now that, Kane took out J and J, took out Kane, or Lesnar took out J and J and Kane. Rollins has no excuses. He's all on his own and he can back up his words and hopefully he can. So uh yeah, that's what I took from Raw. You guys can comment, um, subscribe, you know the deal. Adios.